Okay, so now what I got here is uh, yeah, it's a water bottle that filters water. And this is the military type. It's like a life straw or whatever. So it has a, a filter right here. A little micro biological filter that uh, it'll filter out lead even. It gets everything out of the water. Man. Let me screw this on. And of course it has a, a straw right there, see? So I always carry one of these here lately. I am never used to really care much about using one of these. And, um, but now I do. Now, now I, I, you know, I, I see the importance of, of having something like this. And you can make, you know, equivalent uh, stuff from things out in nature. Um, you know, you can make a water filter that's, you know, a layer of charcoal and sand and gravel and, you know, layers of material like that, and you pour water through it, and it filters out everything and gives you clean water at the end. But, you know, it can take a lot of effort to gather all those materials together and put them in one place at one time to be able to do that. It's not a, not a quick, easy thing. But th this is quick and easy. You, know, you just you fill this up with water, with your dirty water. You put, put the lid on, and then you can either drink directly from, the, from this, or you can squeeze the water out into another container and, you know, do a large volume of water that way. And that's usually what I do. I usually never drink directly from this because you don't want to put your mouth on the straw, right? Because, you know, bacteria, it, it can contaminate this whole entire thing just with your mouth. So that's why I, I'll fill this up with water and then squeeze it all out into another container. And then I'll drink out of that container. And that way this always stays clean. So this is another very important tool to have out in the woods.